Black versus white, rich versus poor, these kinds of conflicts are such a bore. If you like your hatred a little less bland, I have something to meet your demand. You see, America is filled with all kinds of races, colorful faces from various places. So after you're born, it doesn't take long to know exactly what side you're on. In India, people look much more the same, but getting along would be so lame. So they got together and all decided they needed a way to stay divided. After endless searching, they found one at last and created a wonderful thing called caste. Everyone's names would be collected and given a cast that was randomly selected. Some got high cast and celebrated proudly. Others got low ones and cried very loudly. When the process was done, everyone went home with a brand new identity to call their own. Suddenly, caste became a source of pride or something you desperately tried to hide. People of the same caste felt connected. In other castes, were quickly rejected. In each generation, the separation became stronger. The distance between people grew longer and longer. Until eventually, families began moving west, where their system of caste would be put to the test. Eventually, it came time to meet mom and dad. But the two lovebirds couldn't become one just yet. A list of requirements first had to be met. They liked him more with every question they asked until they got to the question of caste. He didn't know to which caste he belonged, so he asked him if he could call his mom. Suddenly they put an end to affairs, all because his caste was different from theirs. To their daughter, this made no sense at all. How could they reject him for something so small? They told her it was something that she wouldn't understand, but it was clear to them that she had gotten out of hand. So they took away her phone and locked her in her room. 
and went searching for a more suitable groom. When they found one they liked, they set up a date to arrange a marriage and set things straight. The news of this meeting traveled fast. But was it fast enough for the party to be crashed? Luckily, he got there just in time to come to the aid of his partner in crime. He explained that they were in love with each other, but she was being forced to marry another. The parents claimed that it was all a lie and pressured their daughter to quickly deny. Her emotions were being torn apart, but she decided she had to follow her heart. she was sorry for making them look bad but she couldn't turn away from the feelings she had cast means nothing and our love is true and if you give us a chance you'll see that too her parents were moved by her passionate voice and they knew they were left with only one choice they told her that she was dead to them and to never set foot in their house again As the years passed by, they stuck together and braved their way through all kinds of weather. Eventually, they got married and created a home. And one day were blessed with a child of their own. He had his father's nose and his mother's eyes, but what he didn't have gave them the most pride. Because of all they had left in the past, their child was born without any cast. The news of the baby had reached their ears, made them realize their mistake after all these years. They begged for forgiveness for all they had done and asked if they could hold their precious grandson. Would they be accepted or be denied? There really was only one way to decide. <laughs>